So this is my post-concussion syndrome update. Uh, it is the 14th of September, and uh, this marks uh, about five months since I was first injured. And uh, for the past, I would say almost two weeks, I've been dealing with uh, quite a setback. Um, first, it was really stress-oriented, um, really bad fatigue, uh, headaches, dizziness, um, fogginess. And uh, for the last mm, seven days, it's hard because the the time just really, like looking at my watch, looking at the fact that, well, it's the 13th and not the 14th. I think that's that, that says something. But the relative sort of time issue uh, with a concussion syndrome is really difficult. Um, you know, days become weeks, weeks become months, and here we are almost five months from my original injury. Um, can't say things have been going well, they haven't. Uh, in addition to a lot of the kind of standard uh, things that I was dealing with, I am now dealing with a persistent headache that just won't, headache and neck pain that just won't go away. Um, just constant, constant, constant. It's always there. Uh, my fatigue has been pretty high and uh, just, in general, just just kind of struggling. And, you know, it's tough because this far in, I think people expect you to be better. And, you know, it's frustrating because I, I keep putting off commitments. Um, I have a game group, a board game group that I usually do that I, it's always like, maybe next week, maybe next week, maybe next week, maybe next week. And, and every week it's, it's, it's not. And, um, you know, it's always tough uh, now that kids are back at school, you know, not being able to go to school events, uh, turning down, you know, parties. Um, it's all been a lot. I've been doing, you know, more research um, and, you know, coming up with a lot of the same things. So I'm trying to do the best I can. Um, my big goal this week is to just get out and walk every day. Uh, I've been a lot more sedentary because my symptoms have been a lot worse. But, um, you know, post-concussion syndrome is the gift that keeps on giving. So, you know, here I am five months out and, uh, you know, appreciably worse from my last update, which is just, it's just so hard. Um, you know, when you're, when you work really hard to kind of get some level of healing and then you get a setback and it's a real rough setback, um, you know, it, it gets disheartening. I mean, um, it's like going to the gym for, you know, five or six months, you know, becoming, you know, really in shape and, and, you know, really flexible and, you know, really on top, going to bed and waking up the next morning with all that gone and, you know, an extra 10 pounds on. So, you know, that's kind of how it's been with the setback. Um, you know, I figured I'd keep doing these updates at least once a month uh, for all of you who are dealing with PCS uh, or who are um, with people who, uh, where you're the caregiver, which is, you know, probably just as hard to roll. So that's this update, and I wish I had better news. I wish it was better, but it's not. It's worse. And, um, you know, I'm hoping the next time I have an update, it'll be, it'll be positive.